Hello. Don't forget your image. Hello. 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 Hello, and welcome to the next episode of Happy Hour. Today's story is a sad story. It's about a man who had no pants and his life, and he's gonna show you, he's gonna react some of the, the hardships he's gone through in his life having no pants. It's really sad. I, I just can't take it. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> well, I guess we're just gonna bring out the man with no pants. <laughs> Come on out. He has no belt. That's the really main problem. I have boxers, at least, you know? Yeah. Life's been hard for me. Tell us about what, what's been so hard. Well, it's been hard. I've taken a lot of abuse from my peers. They all make fun of me because my pants are down, but it's human nature, actually, to have no clothes on whatsoever. Do you agree with me on that, cameraman? I like to hear that. Oh. Do you have any more questions? Um, where were you born? Yeah, I was born, born in New Jersey. You were born in a native village? I was born in a native what? village called New Jersey. <laughs> what what yeah, area? There's satanic rituals there every day. That's why I don't have a belt. So what do you do with your belt? Well, they burned my belt and sacrificed it to a goat. And then they sacrificed the goat to Satan. That's a big shame. Isn't it, though? I mean, you know, sacrificing your belt to Satan. <sighs> Actually, they sacrificed it to the goat and then the goat to Satan. Well, it, yeah, exactly. Actually, the belt did actually go to Satan because it was the goat's belt. That's after right. Can we please see a reenactment of the satanic ritual? I need a belt, someone. Fade I have out. a belt. Fade it out. I got a belt. Fade <laughs> it out. <laughs> I'll take my belt off. <laughs> This is the reenactment of the satanic ritual that took place in Matt's native New Jersey home. And they stripped him of his pride, his dignity, and his belt. Hello and welcome back to Happy Hour. Brought to you by Happy Cow Lack Snacks. Well, I guess you've seen the ritual. It's very emotional to me. I'm sorry about that. Well, well, my belt's been gone for years now. Well. I, c I can't get any jobs because I have my pants down. I mean, what's wrong with... I went... I couldn't get into Harvard. I, I had... I had, I almost got a scholarship because once they saw me in person with my pants down. I never get any of the girls because they think I'm a pervert. It's just... Uh, so hard. Do you have any advice for fellow fellow friends that might be living in the New Jersey native area. 
Yeah, um, be careful when you go to the satanic cults because they, they take your belt without even, they don't even care. They, they have no mercy. They just take your belt. It's like they would kill someone. This could be you. Please, send money to Matt and other people who lose their belts to cult sensations. Write a letter at the address at the bottom of the screen. Because we got to help Matt. He needs surgery, and he doesn't have this kind of money. And you can, you can help other people, too, who have lost their belts. Because it's a special procedure that costs lots of money, and not everybody can afford to have their belts back on. Well, people have given me a lot of money, but it's not enough to replace my old belt. I mean, that belt... <laughs> It's been in my family for years, and now it's Satan's. What's happened to well, the belt? Oh, oh, for, it's Satan's now. He has it. Well, he's in my family, but it's supposed to go to the youngest son, and he's, like, older than me. Mom always liked him best. I got this is too emotional for me.